Welcome back to Schmitty's Off-Road. Today we got the Pro XP and we're gonna be doing a little bit of a maintenance day today. But before we get into that, I wanted to make sure you guys saw my last video where I give you the details on winning the RPM Power Sports Desert Series exhaust. That's right, I'm doing a giveaway, my 500 subscriber giveaway. That exhaust is gonna be going to one of you guys, a lucky winner is gonna get that shipped to them so they can be ripping their Pro XP like no other. So you're gonna wanna go check out that video. I'll link it down in the description below and get yourself entered to win. There's not a whole lot of time left in that giveaway. So make sure you follow the rules and get yourself entered to win the RPM Desert Series exhaust. But let's get to the action. So if you saw the title of this video, we're gonna be doing an oil change in the Pro XP. But did you know that what's in this box can actually give you more horsepower just by doing an oil change? That's right. What we've got in there is a new product. It's from Evolution Power Sports, but it's in partnership with Motul. So if you guys have heard about Motul, they are a oil and lubricant company. So they've got stuff for like differentials and transmissions and all that kind of stuff. But we're gonna start just with their oil. And I'll, I'll throw up some of the details of what these oils consist of. And they've actually got two different kinds. They've got their kind of race spec oil, which is a 300 V and it's got everything in it from top to bottom loaded race ready. Like you need that if you're going high horsepower racing applications or just high horsepower dune machines, but we're doing their more rider trail, kind of weekend warrior oil change, I guess you could say. So it's just a high, it's 100% synthetic oil. I'll show you more details here in a second, but it's just gonna be more for the every weekend rider, nothing too serious, but it has a lot of the characteristics that the 300V oil has, which is sweet because the stuff that's in there is gonna make your engine last longer. It doesn't burn off oil as quickly as other oils do. I'm not sure on the science behind it, but I'm gonna take their word for it. They've got dozens of hours on dyno testing and field testing. They run this stuff in NASCAR, formula, all kinds of high horsepower, high octane machines, and they've had nothing but good results. You talk to anyone about Motul and they love it. But Evolution Power Sports partnered with them to come out with what's in this box. So we're gonna go ahead, break it open, and see what's inside. First things first, we've got some nice instructions from Evolution Power Sports an instruction card. So they, I think they give you this with all of their products, which is awesome. So they've got a little QR code. You'll scan that and it'll take you to instructions for whatever you're installing for the day. That's where the magic happens, right there. So this is their oil change kit. So it's obviously a Motul oil, but it's by Evolution Power Sports. So it's everything you need in this nice packaged little box. It comes with your three quarts of oil, your pro filter, oil filter, crush washer. It even comes with some gloves, which I never really use gloves doing oil changes, but it is nice and probably a good idea to use them. It even comes with a shop rag. How many times are you running around trying to find a rag while your oil is spilling all over the ground? Well, now you don't have to be running around because they send you one in this box. So let's break it open. You're gonna get your three quarts of oil and it says right on there, this is just the ATV side-by-side -side 10W50. So it's a higher quality oil than what a lot of people run. It is a little bit more expensive, but I am gonna trust that Evolution Power Sports has the best intentions in mind with their oil. I'm sure they run this in all their shop cars. And if it's good enough for Evo, it's good enough for Schmitty's off-road. So we're gonna be running this stuff, check it out, see how we like it. So you got those three, you've got your filter. Looks like a really nice filter. I've never heard of Pro Filter, but again, I'm sure it's pretty high quality. Oh, we even get some stickers. Heck yeah, that right there adds five horsepower. But you also get a new crush washer. So that's nice. I know a lot of kits don't come with those. So that Evo is sending that is very nice. You don't have to run to the hardware store and pick yourself up one. And there, there's your gloves and your shop rag. 
So there you go. That's a heck of an oil change kit. It literally comes with everything included from your oil, filter, to even clean up. So that's, that's awesome that they're finally partnering up and coming out with a high quality oil change kit for the razors and they even have them for Can-Am. So like I said, we're gonna be running the dune slash trail oil, but hopefully if I start racing one of these days, we'll upgrade to the 300V. I think they recommend E85 gas when you're running that oil. And I mean, obviously you can probably do other race gas, but that's gonna be more for your high octane, high horsepower machines. I haven't even tuned mine yet, so probably be overkill. I don't know if it would hurt it, but it would be overkill for this razor. So hopefully in the future we'll be upgrading to that other stuff. But for now, we're gonna try this out and see how we like it. On these pros, they are really hard. I don't know if you guys can see that. They're really hard to get to. You can kind of get into them from the side here, but they're way tucked up in there and they're even at an angle. So I got on Amazon and found this. So it's got a tube with it in, in the box, but it's kind of like a little slide. And in the video I did in November, I kind of made my own out of cardboard, but this is actually gonna slide right up underneath. If you guys can see it in there. And once I pull that oil filter off, all the oil is gonna drain down the slide and it'll go into the tube and then I can have a little bottle sitting down here or something that it goes to. So that's gonna make it a lot easier because before it just runs down the front of your motor and then onto your skid plate. So this little guy is gonna make cleanup a lot easier and I'll link this down in the description. Just a cheap little Amazon plastic piece, but it should help. So like I was saying with that funnel, it's got that tube attached to it and then you can just put a cup or an empty bottle there. And then once you take your oil filter off, all that oil is gonna go straight down the little slide, down through the tube and into the cup. So you're not gonna have any of the mess all over the front of your motor and you will be cleaned up and ready to put your new filter on and finish up your oil change. So that'll make that super easy. And like I said, I'll put that down in the description below if you wanna pick yourself up one of those. I think it's only like 15 bucks and it comes with a funnel and some other stuff, but just a nice way to repurpose something you find online. And then like what I was saying with that oil. So you're probably wondering, how in the heck are you gaining horsepower with oil? Well, I don't know if the dune slash trail oil really gains a whole lot of horsepower. You do get some of the benefits of that race oil, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you or kind of tell you some of the stuff that these oils provide. So starting with the dune oil, which is what I'm putting in today, it's obviously gonna be 100% synthetic and it's got an ester in it or ester technology. It reduces friction. And obviously when you have friction, you have heat and oftentimes that's gonna mean a loss of power, which with the 300V, it's gonna be a little bit better than the dune and trail. Obviously it's a race application, but what they have found is through dyno testing, they've actually gained up to three horsepower, which doesn't seem like a lot, but any little bit helps but the fact that you can gain a little bit of horsepower just from oil, obviously you're not gonna win races because you have that plus three horsepower, but it's the fact that it's allowing your motor to run more efficiently and less resistance, which obviously is gonna mean not as hard on the motor and it's gonna last longer, which is sweet. And it's also gonna coat everything in the motor and that ester basically makes the oil cling to anything metallic. So any metal gear, it's just gonna cling to it. It's not like molasses and gonna be so like sticky that it clings to it, but that's the part of the technology is it makes it cling to this stuff. But like I said earlier, if they're running this stuff in four, five, 600 horsepower cars, it's gonna be perfect for a trail machine. And then obviously one day when I step up and maybe race, I'll go to that higher quality oil, that 300 V and we'll be good to go. But we're gonna go ahead and get the old oil out it's already draining. I got to pull that oil filter off and then we're going to fill her up and we'll be good to go.
one cool thing about that oil, like you guys saw when I was just pouring it in there, it's red. So with that being colored like that, when you change your oil the next time, you're really gonna be able to tell how dirty that oil is because it's gonna obviously be having a change of color. So hopefully there's still gonna be a hint of red the next time I change it. But we're gonna be pushing this oil change pretty far. I'm gonna see how far I can go. Definitely kind of push the limits of what they say in the owner's manual and just put that oil to the test and see how well it does. This last oil change wasn't in there that long, probably only a couple hundred miles, but we have a big Colorado trip coming up. So I wanted to make sure I'm gonna be good to go and not have any issues out there and just give it a little fresh up because it was seven, eight months ago. So, and it's been ran pretty hard. So just wanted to have it updated and ready to go for Colorado but i've got everything filled up new filter on oil is good to go i'm going to blow the clutches out and just get them get all the dust out of them so again we're good to go for colorado and that'll be pretty much it for this video so i appreciate hit that like and subscribe button and drop a comment down below if you run anything from evolution power sports this is the first thing i've actually ran from them i've got a belt tim gauge on the way so we're gonna put that stuff to the test and see how well it all works. And hopefully one day I'll get a tune from them and get this Pro XP burning right. So that's it for the day. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.